If you're an activist or a public scholar, have you ever wondered what's the best way of promoting progressive content that is geared towards doing some good in the world, especially on YouTube? Let's share a few strategies that could help you, but also that could help you help other progressive creators and public intellectuals and activists in putting their content in front of more people. Now, most of the things that I'm going to share with you are the things that I have learned and gleaned from various people on YouTube who teach you how to build a successful general YouTube channel. And I think those strategies also apply to people like us and to the activists who are trying to get their message out. So here are three or four basic steps that you can take to promote your own work, but also to help progressive causes on the internet, but especially on YouTube. First, whenever someone whom you are following or whose content is related to what you're fighting for, any issues of social justice, equality in the world, as soon as you get a notification that their video has come up, that they have posted a new video, always immediately go and check that video out. That tells YouTube that this video was able to garner, let's say, 200 impressions, 200 views within first couple of hours. Those two hours are crucial for any content because that tells the YouTube algorithm, hey, people are responding to this new video, right? So YouTube would automatically pick up on the video based on its metadata and start serving it. But after that, how widely does it serve it to people will depend on engagement. So first step, go check out the video, Preferably watch it till the end, but if not, at least check it out and then give it a thumbs up or add a comment. So always leave a thumbs up and add a comment. Comments and likes and even dislikes decide for YouTube that a video is getting engagement. The most important thing though to promote any YouTube video. For example, we just published this video about the students at University of Liverpool. If you like the content and if you like what the students are saying and would like to support them, you could simply first, you know, check out the video, post a comment, give it a thumbs up, but most importantly, what matters the most to YouTube is if you watch the whole video from beginning to the end, because that tells YouTube not only that people are interested in it, but they are watching the whole video. So what will happen when we do this? Leave a comment, give it a thumbs up, and watch the whole video. What happens is that YouTube algorithm learns this video is getting engagement, People are watching the whole video and they are leaving comments. So what YouTube then does is it starts serving that video on the home page and it starts recommending that video. Look at the statistics of this video that I just talked about. It's been about three hours that it was published. You can already see that YouTube has now picked it up and it started serving it on the home page. What is the YouTube home page? The home page is every single person's feed. As they go to YouTube, a lot of video thumbnails line up there. That is not random. It's based in what that person has watched previously, what they might like. So as soon as a video is featured on the home page, and when YouTube starts recommending it, it explodes, it gets more views. So what does it do then? 
what it does is that the message that you are sending out or that your comrades are sending out through YouTube gets more exposure and can reach more people. So just keep this in mind so that we can work in solidarity and help each other. I do this all the time with my viewing and with the friends whose work I view on YouTube. Check out the video as soon as it comes out. Try to watch it within the first two, three hours of its publication. Leave a comment, leave a thumbs up. And then finally, more importantly, post it on your social media and share it with other people. Now remember, in this world, our voices are already being sidelined. And the best way we can promote each other, we can promote progressive thought and prog progressive politics. The best way we can do on the same social media is by actively engaging the content, sharing it, commenting on it, and watching it. So these are a few steps that I thought I should just share with you. I'm not assuming that you didn't know that, but you know, it's important for us to remind ourselves what better ways are available for us to support all those who are trying to work towards justice, work towards equality in this world. We're trying to create a better world. So that's it. Let me know what you think. Follow the steps on this video as well. I'll be grateful. I will now see you next time. Until then, stay safe, take care of each other. And as always, peace and love.